Okay, Ryan, we're at the house in Darien. Um, this is the house, looking over this way. Looking over this way, this is the front of their house in the driveway. Okay, behind the basketball hoop is where we're gonna back up the chipper with the truck. And we're going to walk straight back here between this tree and this tree. We're gonna put the chipper all the way back here. You see that orange flag? That orange flag right there, that's where the the wood chips are going to shoot to. Okay, that's the location where the wood chips are going to be shot into the woods. As you walk our way over here, okay, what we want to do is we want to be careful when we bring the backhoe here. There is a septic system right here. You see these two orange flags? That's the septic tank. You can't go over that with a machine or a truck or nothing. Okay. As we make our way back here, let me just turn the picture. That big mass right there of all those bramblies and crap, that's all getting, that first is going to get cut, cut with a chainsaw. That's all going to get chipped up. Then after it gets cut with a chainsaw, we're going to bring the backhoe in here and we're going to grapple all the roots out of the ground to prepare it for lawn. Okay. Above that, above that is this big beech tree. That beech tree, we're going to have to make about 10 to 12 cuts to trim those lower branches off the beech tree so it gets more sunlight in there. And then against the kind of like, you see there's forsythia to the left, a plant called forsythia to the left, and there's forsythia to the right. There's two orange flags showing where we're going to take all the brush out, and he thinks he wants to put new forsythia where we're taking all these old plants out. All right, and then we look to the left, we scroll to the left, and there's a big dead tree. That dead tree, we're going to drop between this tree and the swing set. We're going to drop it right down here towards the septic system, okay? You can't climb the tree because it's dead, so we have to drop it, cut it and drop it and pull it with a rope, okay? And then he also wants to have the option, I'm going to give an optional cost for trimming two dead branches off this tree. That tree's got two dead branches. I'm going to give an option for trimming that. Um, you know, obviously we might put some topsoil and some seed where we're taking all these grappled and roots out. And again, there's a good chance we'll put some forsythia about 35 feet long underneath this beech tree. That's it, Ryan. Thanks, man. Bye.